Greetings to all of my friends that are listening to the broadcast today. I appreciate so much you tuning into this broadcast. It's my intention to give you the Word of God and be positive and have a positive outlook. And to even telling the truth, you know, when we have a positive attitude, we can still tell the truth. I want us to focus on the 100th chapter, verse number 1. It says, Make a joyful noise unto the Lord all ye lands. We need to be filled with joy. A Christian is filled with joy. They have the fruits of the Spirit in their life, and one of them is joy. We need to have the joy and the peace of God. And then the next verse says, Serve the Lord with gladness, and come before His presence with singing. And that's one of the things we need to come before Him all the time with praise. Before you ask God for any request, you should always get it, begin with praising Him and praising Him from the bottom of your heart because you love Him so much. And you need to just tell Him that you love Him and you care about Him. And you're not just interested in what He might do for you. You're interested in Him because you love Him. He went to the cross and He died for us. He gave His life a ransom. He suffered immensely. And we have a great deal of things that we can praise the Lord for. And then it says, enter His gates with thanksgiving and his courts with praise and be thankful unto him and bless his holy name. There's no other name under heaven whereby I might be saved, but at the name of Jesus, every knee shall bow and every tongue will confess that he is the Lord. It goes on to say, but the Lord is good, verse, verse five, his mercy endureth forever and to all generations you and I, you know, we don't deserve the grace of God. We haven't earned it. Our, our works is not going to get us to heaven. It's because we've accepted the Lord Jesus Christ as our personal Savior. If you don't know him today, you need to repent of your sins and ask him to come into your life. And when you do that, the Holy Spirit moves in and you start living a different life and you have a different outlook on life. And that's so much to be thankful for when we can praise God for what he's done for us. And, you know, we, we all don't deserve to go to heaven. But when we ask the Lord to come into our hearts, we become a part of family of God. In fact, one scripture says we are become kings and priests unto God. We're going to inherit a great thing, a heaven, a gain and a hell to shun. And folks, I'll tell you what, it's worth given all of your all so that you can serve the Lord today. I want to tell you again that I love you so much and thank you so much for tuning into this broadcast and I'll be bringing another one to you real